Today we pray for new friendship in our lives. Everyone needs more friends. I found that when I bought a new motorcycle, I didn't have anybody to ride with. So I prayed for friendship. And almost overnight, new people came forth. I pray and you pray for new friendship in our lives. We pray that we can be a friend first, that we realize that we're needed, that other people are seeking friends, and we provide that need. We are a friend, we are a friend, and we're seen that way by all. I pray that you have the touch of God upon you, making you a friendly person. I pray in every cell of your being, you radiate out friendship and love. I pray that from the top of your head to the bottom of your feet, you're a friendly person. You have an aura of a friendly person. You have the energy of a friendly person. And all people can sense this in you. I pray that if you're seeking for your soulmate for a lifetime, that you attract this person to you. I pray that you are a person that is radiating out the friendship and the love and the acceptance of the Christ. And all people, they sense this in you, and they're drawn automatically to you. I pray there are no walls that can stop this, no divisions of time or even space. I pray that you find your friends when you need and where you need to find them, and they find you. And I do not pray for temporal friendship. I pray for those friends that will last a lifetime that will be with you through thick and thin, that will always be by your side. I pray that you walk through your life fortified with a support group, many people that believe in you, that are lifting you up, just as you are believing in them and lifting them up. I pray that there are times with your friends, of deep laughter, times of joy, times of discovery, times of doing new things. I pray that your life becomes like a child again, exploring out new friends without the barriers of the insecurities. I pray that in all ways that you will discover and find friends, that they will discover and find you, that there will be no ice-breaking sessions, no uh, qualifying sessions to see if this person fits or this person fits. I pray that there is a perfect fit in all ways and that you will be attracted to people of like mind and they will be attracted to you. I ask God to help you find these people and I ask God to help them find you, and that it will not be a struggle, that it will be easy and automatic, that you'll widen your circle, not just in a small space with a small pond fishing, but a wide universe finding all your good everywhere. I pray and I decree in Jesus Christ's name that you are a person with many friends, that you are a person that discovers friendship and friendship discovers you. I pray that you have a life that is filled with joy because of the laughter and the fun that you have in companionship. And I pray that the days of being alone are ended. In Jesus Christ's name, I so decree and believe without doubt. Amen. Positive Christianity. The reason I'm coming to you in this way is to invite you last minute to go on our spiritual retreat cruise in November. 
You may think that's a long way away, but on spiritual retreat cruises, it must be booked a long way away in advance. And we're running out of time. We have it on sale right now for $8.99. That includes all morning programs, three spiritual retreat programs, and evening prayer services. It includes all port charges, all government taxes. All you pay for is transportation to port, the beautiful port of Miami Beach, Florida. And then our cruise ship, one of the largest ships in the world, the brand new Norwegian Escape, will sail to Tortola, to St. Thomas, and then to Nassau, and returning again to Miami Beach. Next November, Saturday to Saturday, leaving on the 12th of November. Join us. We would love to have you with us, but you must commit now with a small deposit on the cabin of your choice, and then much later on, your final payment will be due.